tonight. There's many people involved in this program, so a lot of work and thought has gone into this program, so thanks to Juanita. Thanks to a lot of the sound and the lighting. As you can see, everything's decorated so nice. Thank you for those hands. I want to also thank you for um, the people that put together the little bags of goodies for the kids tonight and the hands that have made the refreshments for later on and um, people that were involved in costume and stuff. A lot of work has gone into the program, so thank you for those many hands. So, and um, tonight I just want you to know that there's so many of us together that um, this is our first dress rehearsal. <laughs> we, we practiced many times, but this is the first night that we're all together, so it's kind of exciting. So just sit back and um, in, enjoy the evening. And um, just I just would like to open with a word of prayer. Dear Heavenly Father, I just thank you so much that we can come to your house and put on this um, program. Lord, I just um, thank you for the friends and the family and the neighbors that are here also. And I just pray that you will bless our time together. And Lord, now I just pray that you will be with the little angels, the big angels, as they do their pieces, as they sing songs, and lift up you and glorify your name, dear Lord. And may the true meaning of Christmas be brought forth tonight. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. Would you please all stand and open your hymn book and sing page 179, Angel We Have Heard on High.
I hope you're ready to celebrate the birth of Jesus. We're looking forward to sing. Is that all we're going to do is just sing? That's the plan. Our singing will be wonderful and heavenly and it's been for 2,000 years. I was wondering if, well, maybe we could do something a little bit different for Christmas this year. Yeah, I thought we could do something a little bit too, a little bit something different too. Different? Why all of a sudden does everyone want the celebration to be different? Do you mean to tell me that you don't want to sing? We're angels, singing is one of our favorite uh, things to do.
sounds as if some humans are pretty mixed up. I don't think we should forget the real meaning of Christmas. Could we do a dramatic presentation with guitars and drums and lights? A dramatic presentation. First Ryan, now you. We've been doing the same thing for over 2,000 years. Why would we want to change now? The cherubs have been working very hard to prepare a dra dramatic musical presentation for this year's pageant. Well, all right, then. Let, let's see what you and Ivy have prepared for us. Oh, good. They've been practicing so hard. They're pretending to be stars, you know. Stars? That's cool. Let's get started. that in those days a decree went out from Caesar Augustus all the world should be taxed. And this taxing was first done when Serenius was governor of Syria. And all went to be taxed, everyone into their own city. 
And Joseph went up from the town of Galilee, out of the city of Nazareth, and into Judea, and unto the city of David, also known as Bethlehem. Because he was of the house of lineage of David, he, he was to be taxed with Mary, being great with child. And so it was that while they were in Bethlehem, time came for the baby to, born, to be born. She had a baby boy, wrapped him in swaddling clothes because there was no room for him to be in. That night, we angels of all creation had reason to praise and worship him.
And suddenly, with the angel, appeared the heavenly hosts, praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest, and on the earth peace, goodwill towards men. Glory to God in the highest, and on the earth peace, goodwill toward men.
just as we angels told the shepherds on the hillside about Jesus. We shepherds glorified and praised God and told everyone we saw about Jesus. And just like and just like we that saw the saw the star shining in the east and came to find the Christ child. Everyone can let their light shine because when Jesus lives in a person's heart, they can sparkle and glow and share God's love with everyone.
in the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. He was in the beginning with God. All things were made through him. Without him, nothing was made that was not made. In him was the light, and the light was the light of men. The light shines in the darkness, and the darkness has not overcome it. The true light that enlightens every man has come into the world. He is in the world, and the world was made through him. Yet the world knew him not. He came to his own house, and his own people did not receive him. But to those that received him and believed on his name, he gave power to become the sons of God, who were born not of blood, nor of the will of the flesh, nor the will of man, but of God. The word became flesh and dwelt among us in grace and in truth. And we beheld his glory, even as the only Son of the Father. Someday, all the people who believe in Jesus will come here to heaven forever. Won't that be great? Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> If you confess with your mouth Jesus is Lord and believe in your heart that God has raised him from the dead, you will be saved. For it is with your heart you believe and are justified, and it is with your mouth that you confess and are saved. As the scripture says, everyone who trusts in him will never be put to shame. For there is no difference between Jew and Gentile. For there is same Lord is Lord of all and richly blesses all who call on him. For everyone who calls on the name of the Lord will be saved.